Hey guys, what's up? Happy Friday. So for months now, thousands of my followers have been asking me every single day, what's your skincare routine? What's your skincare routine? And so I'm finally ready to divulge my secrets. I've been meaning to make this video for a while now, so I really hope that this can help you guys in your quests in finding radiant, healthy, flawless skin like me. So the first thing that I do when I wake up in the morning is I wash my face with First Aid Beauty's Ultra Repair Face Wash. It's really important that you apply it in a circular motion. Next, I lather my skin in a mask of coconut oil. After that, with the coconut oil still acting as a foundation, I apply dead rose petals to my skin. Now, it's incredibly important that you use dead rose petals as opposed to live rose petals because the fragrance in live rose petals can cause inflammation, especially in sensitive skin. You're gonna wanna keep those dead rose petals resting on your skin for about 7 to 13 minutes. So you're gonna wanna be extremely careful with this next step, but it's arguably the most important, so don't skip it. You're gonna shatter a wine glass and you're gonna use the shards as an exfoliator. This step is so important for two reasons. One, because the glass shards are sharp enough to shed your skin of any and all dead cells. And two, the temperature of wine glasses are perfect for reducing pore size. Now, I know breaking a wine glass every single day can get expensive. So if you head on over to my bio, you can find a link to buy cheap wine glasses in bulk. So this next step might sound a little bit crude, but trust me, you can ask any dermatologist and they will recommend it. You're gonna wanna take a scoop of your cat's feces, massage it between your hands until it's soft, and then apply it directly to your face. If you don't have a cat, don't worry. You can get your neighbor's cat, you can get your friend's cat, you can get your mom's cat. Anybody's cat will work for this. But it is a must because the vitamins found in cat poop make for a moisturizer you simply just cannot find in stores. After about two minutes or so, you're gonna take a wet washcloth and wipe the excess poop off your face. You can also rinse it if you want, but I prefer to leave a little bit on for all day conditioning. I finally finish up by massaging a dime of First Aid Beauty's Ultra Repair Cream into my skin to really lock in all that moisture. And I'm ready to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope this helps. So have an amazing weekend and don't forget to subscribe.